Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about factoring trinomials. We're going to factor each one uh, completely. So if I was given this trinomial, 5n squared plus 10n plus 20. All right. Well, I really like it easier. It's easier when our a value is 1. So I'm going to see if I can pull out this 5 from all parts. Well, 10 and 20 both are divisible by 5, divisible by 5. So I can pull out a 5 here. Then I'm left with just an n squared there, plus 5 goes into 10 2 times, so we have 2n right there, and 5 goes into 24 times. Okay, so now we have 5 times n squared plus 2n plus 4. So we have to ask ourselves the question now, what multiplies to be a 4 but adds to be a 2? Hmm, this one's a little tricky. Let me, uh, let's go make a table. Let's make a table of all the numbers that are multiplied to equal 4, all the two numbers here. Well, 1 and 4 equal 4. 2 and 2 equal 4, okay? And then I can flip those, and you're going to have to say 4 and 1. What about negative, you know, right? Negative 1 and negative 4, and negative 2 and negative 2, right? They both multiply, all these multiply to be a 4. So those are all the combinations that two numbers that multiply to be a 4. So let's go see uh, if they can add to be a 2. 1 plus 4 is 5, so no. 2 plus 2 is 4, nope. Negative 1 plus negative 4 is negative 5, nope. Negative 2 plus negative 2 is a negative 4. So we have no options, right? All the combinations that multiply to be a 4, none of them add to be a 2. And so that's it. We have factored this out completely as it is, okay? And we kind of don't necessarily say it's not factorable or not, because we pulled down a 5 from it. Um, but really, we're left with just 5 times n squared plus 2n plus 4 as our final answer. So let's recap, we're going to have 5n squared plus 10n plus 20, and we had to factor that. Well, we saw 5 went into all parts, so we pulled that out. After that, though, we see, saw what numbers multiplied to be 4, but added to be 2. We asked that question, and nothing came up. So nothing came up. We're just left with this as our final answer, 5 times n squared plus 2n plus 20.